everybody. My name is Darlene and I have Parkinson's. I'm also very tired right now. My subject today was going to be, am I still out of breath? And my answer was going to be, no, I'm doing pretty good with that. Not today. <laughs> we, had, we started the day, um, we did a few things around the house and whatnot, but then um, we were very fortunate. Kel and Ashley and Finn came over. Oh my goodness, didn't we have fun? We just had a ball. But anyway, so we played and we danced and we did all sorts of things and it was lovely. But you know, I, I get very tired. So anyway, I was tired. So after they left, Bill said he was going to go and lay down for a little bit. And I thought that sounded pretty good. But then I thought, you know what? I want to make some maritime brown bread today. Um, I, I saw Plus Size in Canada making it. And it brought back memories for me and I thought, oh, I'm going to make some. So I started to make the bread and uh, I've got it in one of the rise situations right now. And um, and then my husband had swept the floor and I thought, oh, I, I should mop the floor. So then I mopped the floor and I have just tuckered myself out and now I'm having a heck of a time. I'm waiting for my meds to really start working effectively. Just took them a little bit ago. I'm not doing as well on my water date. Look at this. We're at 3 o'clock and I'm only at 11 o'clock here. So I better get drinking my water. So um, that's what was going on there. So uh, as far as being out of breath, uh, normally I'm not because I the dyskinesia is not so bad anymore. Because she put me on a different medicine for that. But I don't know. It's, it's one of those things that every once in a while if I do a little bit too much or something then then I am feeling it and uh, so and Claudine's not coming over today uh, she's gonna have the day off which that was so nice for her to have a chance to do that and uh, she's been taking us out for the last two days so she really uh, deserves to have some time off and, and enjoy herself I was going to tell you about a, a trip that we took um, this was when my husband first retired and we wanted to celebrate, so we took three months and we went across the country. And the thing is, we were going to surprise people in Nova Scotia, and we didn't tell them that we were coming. So I didn't even have a proper address because they lived way out in the boonies. And I didn't have a proper address. I knew they lived in a big white house at the top of the hill. Well, every house in Nova Scotia is a big white house, farmhouse on the top of a hill. So we got out there and I was like, okay, well, I know their post office box is in this little town. So we went to that little town and just stopped and asked somebody and told who we were looking for. And of course they knew who they were and told us where they were. So we went to their house. They weren't home right at that moment in time. So we just took our opportunity to pitch our tent in their yard. And when they came home, they were pulling into their driveway. I was like, well, who's in our driveway? They certainly didn't expect to see us. We had a great holiday and then um, they were taking holidays and going over to Prince Edward Island. So we went along too and we just took our tent and went too and oh, we just had a, a, such a good time. So then when we came back home again, Bill worked um, a different job just because we wanted to wait for our son to finish high school. So he worked a different job and then five years later we actually moved to Nova Scotia and we're there for 10 years. We loved it. We really did. But uh, that was such a fun surprise, you know, like when somebody has no idea that you are coming and, uh, you know, and you're not going to be imposing because you've got your tent and everything else. You're just going to pitch it in their yard and, and whatnot. And we really had a good time with that. And so, oh my goodness, I just wish I wasn't so out of breath today. Anyway, I don't have much more to say about um, the trip other than how enjoyable it was. I, I really had a good time with it. And um, one of these days I want to show you my, my, my scooter that's got all their flowers and everything all blinged out on it. But I just, I don't have it in me today to go over and do that. I'm going to rest until it's time for my bread to finish rising. And then I'll pop it in the oven. I can't wait to smell that lovely smell coming through the house. Anyway, I'm going to leave it at that, and when, one of these days I will have to show you um, me making bread, uh, but I'm not very good at it, and so I just thought I would just do this one on my own. Anyway, 
it's very good talking to everybody and I'm looking forward to seeing everybody again tomorrow.